of human endurance. The amazing Randy, who is internationally regarded as Houdini's successor, will encase himself in this freezing ice coffin and attempt to stay in there long enough to break his own Guinness World Record of 52 and one half minutes. Today, he hopes to survive 55 minutes. On the spot to recount Randy's progress is our daredevil reporter, Dawn Clark, and our paramedic, Ron Zielinski. Good luck. Thank you very much. Pulling it out. I'll put it back in again. Okay, it's in. Seal it in. I feel like zero over zero. We'll be checking back for on-the-spot progress reports. One of entertainment's most dangerous thrill acts is the human cannonball. In addition to countless broken bones, there are recorded at least 40 fatalities. Within seconds, we will hopefully witness another successful attempt. As this performer is blasted over my head, it will mark his professional debut as the human projectile. I give you a man who hopes to be catapulted into fame with no injuries, Bob Yerkes. This is going to be my first performance with a cannon. I've done a lot of high falls before, but this is going to be the most terrifying. At the age of 13, Bob ran away to the circus where he became legendary for his aerial artistry. Now he's one of Hollywood's most highly regarded stuntmen. Today, he'll be relying on his acrobatic expertise for the successful execution of this infamously hazardous feat. Ladies and gentlemen, Bob Yerkes. Stay clear. Here we go, folks.
It's a pleasure for me to introduce to you a gentleman who for three decades has been one of Hollywood's most colorful professionals. The Cherokee warriors were renowned for their expertise with knives and tomahawks, and this member is no exception. In that great tradition, we present the world's most thrilling precision knife and tomahawk act. Please welcome Chief Grey Otter and Bambi. Dramatic car sequences are the most lasting memory of any action film. Right now, we're going to meet two men who are regarded as the most outstanding practitioner of the car stunt. Or as professional stuntmen call their maneuvers, gags. Alan Gibbs was the driver in Smokey and the Bandit. And Gary McClarty was the originator of the stunt you're about to see. The cannon roll. They prepared something for us which has never before been attempted. The double cannon roll. They will speed across this field at 70 miles per hour in cars that have been rigged with explosively charged cannons. At a carefully choreographed moment, Alan and Gary will detonate their cannons, hurling their cars 15 feet in the air, sending them wildly somersaulting at least five times. The dangers are unbelievable. The cars could crash, collide, explode, or cave in. Both are unquestionably masters of their profession. But what they're about to attempt is thoroughly death-defying. Let's hold our breath for Alan Gibbs and Gary McClarty. Well, what we have in mind to do, we hope it works out. We're going to start back about, oh, I think it's about a quarter of a mile back there. We won't have more than maybe uh, two or three feet between the two of us. And hopefully we'll end up in here. We're planning to get down here right around uh, 70 miles an hour. Sounds good right, to me. 70 is fine. Yep. All right, going to set up, get ready to go, push the button. That's the point of uh, getting scared. If I get scared or nervous, it's after it's all done. And the only really fear involved is not being able to please all the people that came out to watch you do it. That's the only fear there is. I want to get them working on my piece of wire for this board. I'm going to say most of my stuff is until we go. Uh, Come back okay, over yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Okay. 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 Alright, I'm even going to try this bottom guy for now. We'll just leave them all loose, okay? Where are you going to have that bomb, now? The bomb's going to be outside the car on the right hand side. Just take it on the side. Can we start loading up? Let's just load. Okay. Um, you want to yeah, down here now. Back out of our way in that cable yeah, up there. I'm going to go right over there. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Yeah, hey, am I clear behind? Oh, yeah. yeah, you are. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, 
ladies and gentlemen, the double. Let's cross back to Dawn for a progress report as to how the 